for his excellent obligation to the fields of material science, Meokaku has actually asserted that the James Webb Space Telescope has seen six massive frameworks that specialists thought couldn't exist. These assessments have the potential to open up new perspectives in our understanding of the universe. The revelation is both empowering and progressive, challenging existing hypotheses about the development and advancement of universes. It is thus worth keeping an eye on these updates. The confirmation by such a recognized specialist highlights the importance of these disclosures. Mayo Kaku is a striking figure in the scientific field, a physicist of American and Japanese heritage. He is viewed as an expert in both traditional exploratory material science and quantum mechanics. Unlike some more moderate and dubious specialists, Kaku has been receptive to the incredible implications of the James Webb Space Telescope mission. His enthusiasm to embrace new discoveries and share them with the public emphasizes his commitment to pushing our understanding of the universe. We are pleased that this recognized specialist has decided to break his silence and transparently share what can no longer be denied. The excitement and nearly engaged tone of the well-known physicist are evident in his comments on the discoveries made by the James Webb Space Telescope, indicating that this has been a highlight that has stirred his interest. Join us in exploring the repercussions of Mayo Kaku's revelations regarding these six enormous frameworks. Kaku is a scientist who has always been able to contemplate new theories throughout his life. He has shown a responsiveness to ideas that challenge the status quo, recognizing that Einstein's theories of relativity and Newton's laws, while fundamental, are lacking in fully capturing the complexities of the universe. Kaku understands that the discoveries of the new telescope have the potential to enhance the intellectual field, yet many of his colleagues have not embraced this view. This has caused concern and sleeplessness among the Big Bang advocates and opponents of quantum mechanics. However, this only incites laughter from Kaku. The JWST has revealed the existence of six massive cosmic frameworks dating back to the earliest times of the universe. Each of these immense frameworks contains more stars than our own Milky Way, despite having formed just 200 to 700 million years after the Big Bang. The team of space specialists who made the discovery has named these phenomenal frameworks Universe Breakers, since, if confirmed, they would change our entire understanding of the universe. The implications of these disclosures are significant, suggesting that the universe's early years were much more dynamic and complex than previously thought. Something doesn't fit here anymore. The hypothesis of how things came to be tells us that the universe was a chaotic mass after the initial event. The first solid objects required a tremendous number of years to form, and it took countless additional years for the objects to reach sufficient density and produce light. The formation of complex structures, such as frameworks, was believed to occur much later. Some of the newly found universes outshine the Milky Way in size, and their immense brightness suggests that they were likely forming many new stars each year, while our system forms stars only sporadically. It remains unclear exactly when the first universe formed. Researchers have not been able to determine this so far. The only thing that is clear is that initially, there may have been only single stars or clusters of stars, which ultimately coalesced to form increasingly larger structures until dwarf universes developed. The small cosmic frameworks experienced various structures and progressively evolved, contradicting past speculations that organized and massive universes were unable to have existed at that time, which raises the question of whether the universe is much older than recently acknowledged or whether complex cosmic designs developed significantly sooner. This situation is difficult to accept for mainstream science, which still struggles with this model. Several aspects of physics strongly refuse to accept this revelation and question potential errors in the age estimates. Kaku is aware of this and had this to say, There are various models of ancient and misleading theories that determinately persist due to the influence of certain specialists. Many of these theories were perhaps disproven when significant studies exposed their flaws. Consequently, the fundamental word in any science, especially in physics, rests within the experimentalists who keep researchers alert and aware. As a matter of fact, on Earth, we have scarcely any insight into the authentic beginnings of the universe. This statement from Kaku highlights the importance of consistent experimentation as well as validation in the scientific process. The hypothesis of how things came to be was laid out in 1927 based on observations of the expansion of the universe. This information led to the conclusion that the universe began from a single point and has been expanding ever since. At the time, 
it was hard for people and scientists to imagine a universe with a beginning and an end. The idea of a universe that had always existed and was infinite in reality was beyond people's imagination. Without a doubt, even today, scientists still face challenges in sorting it out. However, it is essential to consider these possibilities. Even these new discoveries do not fit with what researchers have been positing for a long time regarding the hypothesis of the Big Bang. Nonetheless, science has consistently shown that reevaluation and openness to new ideas are a fundamental part of the scientific process, much like the affirmation of specific theories and observations. When Einstein was a child, it was accepted that the stars and planets were firmly fixed in the universe, and these particular designs occupied a defined space. However, we now know that everything in the universe is moving. Planets orbit stars, stars move within their galaxies at numerous kilometers per second, and entire galaxies move rapidly through the universe, the fate of which we cannot yet even predict. This new understanding of the universe challenges long-held beliefs and highlights the necessity for continuous inquiry and change in scientific thought. Today, scientists are challenged to accept uncomfortable bits of understanding and to comprehend that theories are not absolute truths until they are thoroughly tested or confirmed by precise observation. The possibility of the Big Bang arose from the realization that galaxies are escaping from one another, and this distance is comparative with their separation from Earth. This observation, known as Hubble's Law, suggested that the universe was expanding. For some time, elements such as cosmic background radiation and the redshift of light from distant galaxies, along with other cosmological patterns, seemed to support this hypothesis. However, it is essential to remember that previously, People who believed the Earth was flat and that the Sun revolved around us also had observational proof for their doubts until events or technological advancements came along that provided a clearer picture. Right now, we are witnessing a similar situation. Scientists expected the new James Webb Space Telescope to affirm the suspicions related to the Big Bang. However, rather, they have come across these six galaxies that seemed impossible. This shows that science is continually progressing and that researchers must be open to new discoveries and re-examine existing hypotheses based on the available evidence. The startling revelations challenge current understanding and provoke a reassessment of long-standing cosmological hypotheses. Researchers use redshift as a tool to determine certain quantities in the study of the universe. Redshift, otherwise known as the Doppler effect, refers to the change in the color of light as light sources and observers move relative to one another. To understand this, you can imagine standing still and seeing a vehicle coming towards you. As the vehicle moves towards you, you hear the engine getting louder. However, when the vehicle passes you or moves away, the engine sound changes. This is because the sound varies as the vehicle moves. The same is true for light. When a light source, such as a distant star, moves towards us, the light we see shifts towards bluer tones. Conversely, when the light source moves away from us, the light shifts towards redder tones. This phenomenon is called redshift. Physicists have converted redshift values into velocities and distances for measurement in the study of the universe. However, it is important to note that even a small error in these measurements can have significant consequences. The measurement techniques recently used are now under review. The latest discoveries related to our universe require consideration of whether they are genuinely based on redshift errors or whether some scientists are simply denying the facts. This is a question that requires thorough investigation and careful review of the data and methods used in the research. The current investigation and reassessment of measurement techniques highlight the evolving nature of scientific inquiry. Many thanks for watching the video. As always, we remind you that you can post your questions in the comments box. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit the like button, share it so it reaches more people, and subscribe to the feed so you don't miss more content like this. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one. This call to action empowers viewers to engage with the content, encouraging a community of curious minds eager to explore and grasp the latest scientific discussions. The examination of our universe, with its vast expanses and complex celestial bodies, continues to interest and challenge scientists across the globe. From early theories about the universe to the latest revelations made possible by cutting-edge technology, every discovery reshapes how we understand the universe and stretches the boundaries of human knowledge. One of the most critical and enduring inquiries in cosmology revolves around the origin and evolution of galaxies.
Galaxies are like cities of stars, gas, dust, and dark matter bound together by gravity. Understanding how galaxies form and evolve is vital not only for unraveling the mysteries of our universe but also for affirming or testing existing hypotheses, such as the theory of the universe's origin. The theory of the Big Bang, proposed nearly a century ago, suggests that the universe began from a single, infinitely dense point and has been expanding ever since. This idea arose from observations of the universe's expansion and the cosmic microwave background radiation, which are considered the remnants of the early universe's extreme heat and light. However, recent discoveries, particularly those made by the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, have challenged several key assumptions underlying the Big Bang Theory. The JWST, with its unprecedented sensitivity and resolution, has identified galaxies that appear significantly larger and more advanced than expected for their age. One such discovery involves six massive galaxies dating back to when the universe was only 200 to 700 million years old, a mere blink in its 13.8 billion year history. These galaxies, dubbed universe breakers by the research team, challenge conventional understanding because they are already so large and bright at such an early cosmic stage. The discovery of these galaxies raises intriguing questions about the rapid development of the early universe and challenges existing models of galaxy formation. According to prevailing theories, galaxies formed gradually over billions of years through the merging of smaller structures and the accumulation of gas and stars. The existence of these gigantic galaxies so early in cosmic history suggests a more complex and potentially faster process of galaxy formation than previously thought. Moreover, the discovery highlights the significant role of technological advancements in reshaping our understanding of the universe. The JWST's ability to peer deeper into space and capture faint light from distant galaxies has allowed astronomers to unveil previously invisible aspects of the universe's early development. These observations provide valuable insights into the conditions and processes that governed galaxy formation during the universe's infancy. The implications of these discoveries extend beyond the realm of astronomy. They challenge scientists to revisit and refine existing cosmological models to better account for the observed diversity and complexity of galaxies across cosmic time. They also underscore the dynamic and evolving nature of scientific knowledge, where new discoveries can prompt paradigm shifts and open new avenues for exploration. As scientists continue to investigate and interpret the data from the JWST and other observatories, the study of galaxy formation remains a dynamic and developing field of research. Each new discovery brings us closer to unraveling the mysteries of our cosmic origins and understanding the fundamental processes that have shaped the universe as we know it today. In conclusion, while the discovery of these six enormous galaxies challenges our current understanding of galaxy formation and the early universe, it also represents a significant milestone in our quest to unlock the universe's secrets. By pushing the boundaries of scientific knowledge, such discoveries pave the way for future breakthroughs and deepen our fascination with the vast and intricate tapestry of the universe. Mayo Kaku, renowned for his contributions to material science, has recently made intriguing claims regarding the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST. According to him, this telescope has identified six massive galaxies that were previously thought to be impossible. These discoveries could potentially revolutionize our understanding of the universe, as they challenge existing theories about galaxy formation and evolution. The implications of these findings are profound, suggesting that the early universe was far more complex and dynamic than previously believed. Kaku, a physicist of both American and Japanese descent, is respected in both traditional exploratory material science and quantum mechanics. His openness to embracing new discoveries sets him apart from some of his more conservative peers, who may be hesitant to accept the radical implications of the JWST's findings. Kaku's enthusiasm to share these revelations emphasizes his commitment to advancing our understanding of the cosmos. The galaxies discovered by the JWST, referred to as universe breakers, date back to a mere 200 to 700 million years after the Big Bang. Each of these galaxies contains more stars than our own Milky Way, raising questions about how such massive structures could form so quickly in the universe's history. This challenges the long-held belief that galaxies developed gradually over billions of years through the merging of smaller structures and the accumulation of gas and stars. The significance of these revelations cannot be overstated. 
If confirmed, they would indicate that the early universe was capable of producing massive galaxies much earlier than previously thought. This suggests a more intricate and potentially faster process of galaxy formation, which could reshape our understanding of cosmic evolution. The existence of these large galaxies challenges the prevailing theories that maintain galaxies took billions of years to form, thus pushing the boundaries of our current cosmological models. Kaku also highlights the importance of continual experimentation and validation in the scientific process. He emphasizes that scientists must remain open to new ideas, as the history of science is replete with examples where established theories were overturned by new evidence. The discoveries made by the JWST serve as a reminder of the evolving nature of scientific inquiry. Moreover, these findings underscore the vital role of technological advancements in expanding our understanding of the universe. The JWST's unprecedented ability to capture faint light from distant galaxies allows researchers to uncover details that were previously inaccessible. This capability has provided insights into the conditions and processes that governed galaxy formation during the universe's early stages. As scientists continue to analyze the data from the JWST and other observatories, they face the challenge of reconciling these new findings with existing theories. The ongoing investigation into galaxy formation remains a dynamic field, where each discovery contributes to a deeper understanding of our cosmic origins. The revelations from the JWST prompt a re-examination of long-standing cosmological models as they challenge the assumptions that have guided researchers for decades. Scientists now must grapple with the possibility that the universe is more complex and its history more intricate than previously acknowledged. This evolving understanding encourages a culture of inquiry, where new discoveries can lead to paradigm shifts in how we view the universe. In essence, the discovery of these six massive galaxies not only challenges our current knowledge, but also marks a significant step forward in the quest to unravel the mysteries of the cosmos. The enthusiasm and engagement of scientists like Kaku highlight the excitement that comes with new revelations as they inspire further exploration and inquiry into the vast tapestry of the universe. This ongoing journey of discovery is crucial for advancing our understanding of the cosmos and highlights the importance of remaining open to new possibilities. As researchers delve deeper into the implications of these findings, they pave the way for future breakthroughs that could reshape our understanding of the universe and its origins.